What's up, so old? What's wrong with you? Look at this, right? Ice skating event, right? This is stupid event anyway in the world of sport. Ice skating where you jump over barrels, right? Watch this. You're about to see the face of Danny Meeks, right? Think inside your little brain box. Right. I think Danny is this old. Make a decision. I think Danny is years old, right? Don't say it out loud. Just think it in your brain. Then listen, seconds later, to the actual age of Danny Meeks. Our next contestant here for his final jump is Danny Meeks, 18 years old from Flint, Michigan. <laughs> Fuck off! What a liar! Danny, that is, you're lying! <laughs> Look, he's like got that moustache! Look at And his haunted eyes! If under that image it said Danny Meeks, 36 years old, you go, he must have had a tough paper round, poor old Danny. <laughs> Right? And he'd just come back from having a year off with a fractured leg, right? You'd think that Danny would approach ice barrel skating with an air of positivity. Right, I'm not going to spoil this. I've worked hard. I've had my year of rehabilitation. I am Danny Meeks, teen heartthrob Danny Meeks, the David Beckham of the world of ice barrel skating. I am Danny Meeks. Right, it's been out a year. Focus, Danny. Then balls this up. You ready, Dan? Yes, I'm definitely ready. Had a fractured leg a year ago. Out with that injury, Danny me uh oh, overextended himself. Danny, you idiot! <laughs> well, that's disappointing, but I'll be back next year when I'm 40 19 years old. <laughs> Look at this bit of Danny Meeks being led off all sort of embarrassed, right? And then when you think, oh, the world of Danny Meeks can't shock me anymore, right? I've learned all I can about Danny. Nothing else weird will happen in this bonkers context that Danny created for himself. Look in the crowd, at, like one of the people applauding. It's ridiculous. And the concern now by the crowd here, is he all right? And I believe he is. They're watching Danny Meeks. Why are they characters from Narnia in the audience? <laughs> well done, Danny. You tried your best, and you'll be a fine skater one day once you get through puberty. But like, it should be this old woman, that. right? This old woman who I think is some sort of refugee from Monty Python, not a normal person. Normal people don't behave like this. She's given some food, new food, exciting food. She enjoys it, then gets told what it is. Oh God! There's that little bit there. It's very nice. Oh, it's shark. It's what? Shark. <laughs> it's funny. See that shark there? It's part of that. one had swum up to her. It's just a slightly bigger fish. There you go, madam. Try a little bit of cod. Oh, yeah, that's lovely. I think you should know, madam, that when alive, that cod used to wear a little hat. What? <laughs> and it was gay. Oh, God! Oh, it's a gay cod! Other beautiful thing about this strongman competition, Listen carefully to the fickle nature of the crowd, right? Listen to their reaction. When things are going well for that cheese-lifting man, they really love him, but the second things go wrong, they fucking write off. Listen. <laughs> oh, fuck off, you shit! <laughs> Can't even lift up a fish tank full of cheese. You're a fucking mug. Right. Also, the strongman competition has this sort of air of erotica because of, I think, physical perfection. It's sort of like it reminds you of gods, doesn't it? Like sculptures of Greek gods and portraiture of modern athletes, right? Look at this bit here. There's this strong man. It's dead berserk, this bit. He's making sort of sexy, wheezing noises while he's doing some weights. But they're the sort of noises that typically should only be made during sex or defecation, right? They're really sort of <laughs> embarrassing noises, like, ooh, 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 ooh. Like sometimes you have to go to the toilet and you're on your own, you think, I'll let my real personality out. <laughs> no one need know of this. Ooh, 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 like that. But I once looked at it with a mirror and thought, no, that's not good. <laughs> and from now on, I sort of go, like that, do a poo with a quiet dignity. Uh, also, so watch and listen to the noises this bloke makes in public. Also, keep an eye out for the man in the crowd that's quite into him. Why is he so into it? Why? 
<laughs> Bastard! That's too much, right? If that's what he's like watching weightlifting, what does he look like when he's watching pornography? Look at him again. Like he's all angry about it. And I think if that bloke was allowed to do what he wanted in that situation, I think he'd run out, sort of jump on that bloke's back, sort of, oh, you big bully, and sort of start crying. You know, sometimes if you find someone sexually attractive, but they